Jackhammer again? Jackhammer again! This could be it! This could be it! No! How can this be? Isn't the jackhammer the most imposing move? I can't believe this! Come on, Scott, what are you doing? What were you doing? That was a beautiful pinning predicament by Scott Pilgrim on Black and Tear. And it was ruined for, for Sky Stanley's offbeat shenanigans. Bo Sabine, Bo Tony Towers got none of them in their tank. And look at that. Oh, give us this their daily break, man. Mangling Blacketeer! Look at this! A pretzel swing! Aw, oh, double team! Come on! Oh, right between the eyes! Shining Wizard! Shining Wizard! Shining Wizard! This has to be it! Oh, for the love of God! This is absolutely off the chains! Absolutely off the chain! There's no referee! Tony Towers is out! But Scott Pilgrim saves the day! He saves him! Good job! Come on, Scott! You're our only hope now! Wait a minute, look at this! Oh my god! Shining Wizard! And there's a jackhammer! No! Make him submit, make him squeal! Beautiful move! A bright move of that! And Tony Tower is doing a backflip, why not? And we'll do it! We'll do the sledgehammer! One! Two! Three! Ah! That was three, damn it! That was three! One, two, three! Finally! Finally, phase one has been completed! Bring out the tables, ladies and gentlemen! Because now it's gonna be a tables match! And Sabine is all by himself! Get back here, Sabine! This ain't over! Alright, now match two. Now we're on the tables part of the matchup. Blacketeer is one tough son of a bitch, but the general of Black Wrestling is gone. Now the newest acquisition to the organization of the stable, Sabine Nabarada. And Sabine is, is retaliating with everything he's got, and Scott Pilgrim, like a good, like, like a true friend and partner, saving, saving time and also damaging. Oh no, what to do? What to do? Oh! Look at that! I think that Tony was gonna fight back, but somehow, some way, the Saudi Arabian monster just knew he was trying to thwart him from that move. <laughs> 
Oh, nice. Standing psyche there by Scott Pilgrim. At this case right now, it's kind of tricky in these kinds of matches. And by the way, folks, this only happened about... This is now the second time this has ever happened. Oh, man! Corkscrew plancha, where did that come from? Good grief. Now tables. Tables! Oh. The advantage right now is that the, 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 the one who's single has to worry about putting both men through a table. That can be fun too. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. No, 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 no! Now it's one-on-one. -on -one. Scott Pilgrim. Here's your winner. Scott Pilgrim and Sabine Nobarda. How about that? Looks like Sabine has the last laugh on that one with Tony Towers. We'll be right back, folks, for our conclusion of this match. All right, the conclusion of our match. Scott Pilgrim and Sabine Nobarda. Oh, Jesus. Get out of the way, kid! Nice! Right into the belly of the beast! A second dive to the belly of the beast! Oh, squash him! Do whatever you can, kid! Look at this guy! Look at this guy just squashing his opponent left, right, and center! Again! This kid is something else! Come on, Scotty! Come on, Scott! Oh, close to that table as well. At this point now, folks, it's a very tight situation. Beautiful area. The winner of this match wins for the team. Either it will be Black Wrestling League, of the team of Scott Pilgrim and, S and Tony Towers. My goodness, this kid likes to fly. Look at this kid. Oh, misses that one. Don't get too cocky, kid. That table in the corner is a problem. Oh, beautiful. Oh, man, nailed to that, Tam. But that woke up Sabina Barter quick, fast, and in a hurry. Oh my goodness! It is all over! Here's your winner, Scott! It is all over, ladies and gentlemen! What a move! What a match! To start things off here, the first No Mercy Hardcore! We got Scott Pilgrim to pierce right through, to penetrate right through Sabine Navarro and the Black Wrestling League. And we got a wonderful score of ABBA in no relation to the 70s or 60s band ABBA. 331% is the final score. Good job, Scott. Looks as though he won't be making it to King of the Ring next Sunday night. I'm proud of you, kid.